Hi everyone, my name is Sam Goldberg. I am the president and co-founder of Kratos. And today I have the pleasure to talk to you a little bit about digital advertising. So digital advertising, there's two types, there's search and display. We're gonna talk about display. Display are those lovely ads that you see when you're enjoying your favorite app or website. Well, there's a big issue with display for advertisers and that is that in any single app or site, there's not enough scale for them to reach a lot of consumers. And so why is that a problem? Because they want to spend money, they want to reach you, their target audience. And so what emerged was what's called programmatic advertising. And I won't go into all the ins and outs, but let's just say the purpose of programmatic advertising was to aggregate the apps and sites so advertisers could reach you, their target customer, on whatever app or site you are enjoying. So advertisers thought this was a really great solution. But what happened was they had start all the way over here as an advertiser and have to navigate through all these boxes just to reach you as a consumer. And each little line in here is a different company. Total chaos. Chaos. And when there's chaos, there's got to be a referee. To end the chaos, you have to have a referee, some third party, a neutral party, to come in and set guidelines, set rules. Now, why is this important? Well, this is a big industry. Over $200 billion are spent on digital ads every single year. And we know that tens of billions of dollars are wasted completely wasted by advertisers. It's a lot of money, and they know it. And it's been getting more and more in the press, and more and more pressure is being put on advertising agencies and technology companies to deliver for their clients, the advertisers. The transparency problem. Now when, in this industry, there's a lot of data discrepancy problems, a lot of fraud, and when data discrepancies exist, and fraud exists, what type of technology solution could apply really well? Do, 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 blockchain. So what we've done at Kratos is we created a protocol and built apps on top of the protocol. We also invite third parties to also build apps on our protocol to bring transparency and solutions to this $200 billion market. Now, we are not trying to tokenize this whole economy, this whole system. We don't want to change any behavior that advertisers are currently doing. And we're not asking them to make new technology investments. What we are doing is we are bringing the advertisers and the publishers, the apps and the websites together and bringing a unified set of data by verifying each and every ad that you see. Our first application is bringing transparency to the supply chain so an advertiser knows when they spend a dollar where that dollar actually goes. And we're also preventing fraud by making sure that publishers don't get their domain spoofed, meaning that if an ad's supposed to go to CNN, it actually goes to CNN and not some site claiming to be CNN and takes that ad and gets that money. This is an example of what should happen now, most advertisers think they're spend $100, that $100 go to the website or app. That's not actually the case. This is how the breakdown should be. But that's not in reality what happens because there is no transparency in this industry today. And so the actual amount that goes to the publisher is not $40. It's actually far lower than that. As I mentioned, we're stopping identity theft. Identity theft in this case, domain spoofing. So stealing of domains identity, not personal identity, totally different thing. As a company, we're based in Los Angeles. We're a growing team. We have a fully operational product. We've gotten great traction. We'd love to show you guys a live demo. And I also want to tell you that this will be the last public appearance for Kratos. We have some very exciting news. We're going to continue as a company. We have some very exciting news coming up in this next week. And I look forward to delivering that. So I thank you guys for the attention. Had a great time at Block to the Future. And my grandfather would be so proud. He was a, the equivalent of lieutenant in the Navy. He'd be so proud of actually speaking on an aircraft carrier. So thank you very much, everybody. Appreciate it. <laughs>